Hey everyone, it's Reverend Ron here at Unity of Fairfax, and yes, this is a frog swinging and resting peacefully on a lily pad. Back to the frog in a moment, though. Several weeks ago, the Unity Eastern Region hosted its annual fall conference, and for the second year in a row, it was an all-virtual conference this year. The conference theme was Reimagining Community, Birthing a New Paradigm, a new paradigm for ministers, for church, for community, and unity. And the workshops and discussions that week were around just that. What is this new experience of church, this new paradigm that has been ushered in by the pandemic? And where are we being led in a post-pandemic experience of church? And what was wrong with the old paradigm? As we engaged with these questions during the conference, there was anxiety and fear and a sense of loss of what was, balanced with a faith and an excitement of what could be. There were lots of questions, some of which we just don't have answers for yet balanced with open hearts and minds and a lot of creative energy and innovation that was shared. And there was much time for centering and prayer and meditation, directing us back to the source of our faith. One of the conference sessions was entitled Four Questions for Birthing a New Paradigm. The four questions being, how and where will we do ministry? What individuals do we want to attract? What community partners are we seeking? And what teachings are our guides? This was a session primarily for ministers and spiritual leaders of Unity Communities, and I led the opening prayer for the session with an invitation to, before we explore and brainstorm and share questions, concerns, and visions of what could be, let's take a moment to center in an awareness of God in the midst of us, that of God within that is mightier than any circumstance, so that our doing this day, this week, and going forward flows from a sense of our beingness, our oneness with the allness, the goodness, the love of God. I invited conference folks, and I invite you, our Unity of Fairfax community, to begin in stillness, in silence, to begin by holding the heart of our community in the light, in a space of knowing God in our midst, and a knowing that out of the silence, way will open. And so today, an invitation to join Reverend Russ and myself in holding the heart of this community in the light, the heart of the community being the sacred communion of each of your hearts who call Unity of Fairfax your spiritual home. I hope you'll join us in this prayerful practice. Now back to the FROG. FROG is an acronym, F-R-O-G, fully relying on God. And this is a reminder for me, for you, to center in that consciousness as we walk in the mystery, all the while affirming, God is my all, I know no fear, for God and love and truth are here. Amen. Blessings, friends.